is exciting, Amy. They've been waiting months to see the Rams back in action right here in Los Angeles, and it's going to happen today, although this is a preseason game, and it's the third preseason game, so you're not going to see a lot of your starters, if any at all, but you're going to see a lot of guys really hungry to be on this team and a lot of fans really excited to be here. But the big show may actually be the new facility, and that is, of course, the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum right here behind me. It's hard to see in there right now, but it's not hard to see those bright red seats across the way. That's because this whole place is brand new. Take a look at this video from inside the stadium. The renovation, which began in January of 2018, did drop the Coliseum's capacity from 93,000 seats to 77,500 seats, but there's a reason for that. It's because all these seats are brand new. They're a little wider. They're a little bigger. There's more room in the aisles, and so that means it's going to be a much more comfortable game experience for everybody who's coming in here. But it's not just the seats that are new. There are new suites. There are 650 video screens throughout the stadium for folks to watch that game wherever they are, including in the concession stands. The whole new south side structure was added, which includes the new suites, boxes, club seats, a concourse, and a brand new press box for those who are up there. The stadium has new lighting. It's got Wi-Fi, electrical, plumbing systems. You name it, it's there. More leg room, extra aisles, and just beautifully restored. There is no public money that was used in this renovation either. It was entirely funded by USC, United Airlines, and private donors, and that's, of course, why it was renamed the United Airlines Field at the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum. So here's what you need to know before you head out here here today, and that's, of course, the main thing. The thing that changed last year was there's no printed tickets anymore self-printed for the NFL. So don't try and print your tickets at home. You need to put it on the mobile app and use it on your phone that way, or you have to have those original tickets. Also, parking is $50 at all USC campus lots. Parking opens, the lots open five hours before kickoff, which is 1 o'clock this afternoon, and that's when folks can start tailgating. And don't forget to take Metro or ride hailing services, or of course, you can also carpool to get here because that's going to be a traffic over the nightmare. Broncos versus the Rams tonight at 6 o'clock on our sister station, CBS2. Pre-game coverage starts at 5.30, and you don't want to miss it. And before I go, I want to show you what we got out here, and that is the beginning of Fan Fest. This is the kids' zone side. They're going to blow all those things up. It's going to be a great day to come out here, so get out here early. Fan Fest actually starts at 2 o'clock this afternoon, an hour after these parking lots open. So just because the game isn't until later, that doesn't mean you can't get down here and enjoy the fun much sooner. Amy. And it is a lot of fun, Joy. Thanks so much.